Hello everybody. All right, welcome to bar. This is gonna be a 20 minute workout. Um, today, all we need is our squishy ball. Okay, so if you got one of these, go ahead and grab it and have it ready to go. We're just gonna start with a quick warm up and um, we're gonna basically work each side on our warm up and then we'll go right into this. We are doing a lot of leg work in the next 20 minutes. So just be prepared for that and we will be working our triceps today as well. So. Let's go ahead and get warmed up. Please ignore my dog. I'm, I'm babysitting her while my husband's working right now on a work call. So we're doing what we need to do, right? All right, so we're gonna go ahead and just step forward and reach and then pull back. So we wanna keep the tummies in and keep a straight line down that back. So big reach and a pull, reach and pull. Good. Let's go ahead and do four more. Three, two, and last one. Go ahead and step out, open those arms, and step in. Step out and in, out and in. Good, so we're just stepping, working those legs, getting them warmed up. Keep those arms up right about shoulder height. Last four, three, two, one, and come back to center. Stay right here, shoulders are back, knees in, and we're just gonna tilt forward and up. Forward and up. Good. While I'm doing this, I might as well track my workout, right? <laughs> Make it count. It's four, three, two, and one, awesome, switch sides. So we're gonna big, big reach up and pull, reach and pull. Good, make it a little bit deeper this time. So tip forward at those hips a little bit more, keep the back nice and straight, hips forward, bellies in. Here's four, three, two, last one, and go ahead and step out and open, step in. Got my dog stuck in the way. I tell you what, taking care of a puppy is seriously like taking care of a little kind, tiny little human person. There's four, three, two, one more. Excellent job. All right, here we go. Tilt and up, tilt and up. <clears throat> Last four, three, two, one more, and awesome job. Quick reminder, if you're not sure about bar, um, there's no impact with bar. It's small, little moves, lots of pulses, and very light weights, and sometimes no weights at all. Getting into those muscle fibers, those really small little things around our muscles, okay, that we can't get to using heavier weights. I mean, you can, but you're not gonna really target those. So doing bar workout is great for anybody and everybody, okay? So again, today we're not using weights. We're just using this as our resistance. So go ahead and grab um, your ball and we're gonna put it right between our knees here. I got my little cheat sheet piece of paper here and I can't see it from over there. All right, so. We're gonna bring our feet in close together, shoulders are back, chest lifted, and we're just gonna start with some low squats down and on the way up, we're gonna squeeze that ball. All right, here we go. Take it down, squat, and then squeeze the ball. Down, squat, and squeeze. Squat, and squeeze. Good, down, and squeeze. Now, during these workouts, feel free to play your own music, okay? Anything that's gonna get you pumped up. Down and squeeze, down and squeeze, down and squeeze, down, one more, down and stop. Good, so we're gonna take it down low and then come up slow. So go as low as you can, make sure those feet are in close together, shoulders are back, bellies are in ready. Let's go down and then up slow. Uh, down, 
slow. Down, now if you need to remove your ball at this point, go ahead and do that. The purpose of bringing your feet in close together is so the ball doesn't fall to the floor. And holding the ball between the legs this whole time is really making those inner thighs work. You're probably feeling it right about now. Squeeze, good. We got two more. Good, and last one. Good, we're gonna take it down, hold it down at the bottom as low as you can. Hips are back, ready. Pulses and squeezes with the ball. Little pulses, stay low. Oh my gosh. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Good job. I think she just deflated my squishy ball. <laughs> my other one. All right, guys, here we go. We are going to um, go down halfway and then we're going to stay on the top half. So it's down and up, halfway down and up. So we're working the top half. So if you think of a full range, oh yeah, she deflated it, all the way down and up, range of motion on your squat. We have the midpoint, and then we have the bottom half to the halfway point, and then we got the halfway point to the up, standing tall. So we're working that halfway and up. So it's a small little move down. Sorry. <laughs> Free entertainment. It's your bar entertainment. <laughs> Three, two, and one. All right, guys, we're going to take it all the way down halfway. Ready? Squeeze pulses as we pulse up and down right here. God, he's getting me. Good. Here's four. Three, two, and one. Oh, remove. Okay, you got water handy, go ahead and grab it and take a sip. All right, tricep push-ups. If you need to stay standing, you can do your tricep push-ups against the wall. So if you've got shoulder or wrist injuries or you can't go down on the floor for any reason, like it's just too hard to get down and it's too hard to get back up, okay, that is perfectly fine. Fine. Okay, that's just where you're at in life. Um, you can stay against, and I'm using my hands, that's the only reason I'm putting the ball here. You can stay against the wall with your hands about this wide. Okay, so not too wide, right about here. So here's my wall. I'm just gonna do tricep push-ups and push my body away from the wall, coming in close to the wall, okay? And of course you won't have this, actually you will have this between your legs. Okay, otherwise everybody else, those of you who can go down the floor and want to go down to the floor, we're gonna go on down. So hands are gonna be right about shoulder width on this. And we're just gonna do a bunch of fun little things down and up with that. We're not gonna hang out here too long because we don't need to overwork those triceps. All right, hopefully you can hear me on this video. Usually I do all my workouts live but I'm recording this for you guys on Patreon and uh, you know, so hopefully this is turning out okay. It's a work in progress. We'll, we'll figure it out as we go. All right, so here we go. Ball is gonna be between the knees again and then hands are right about shoulder width apart and we're just gonna bring it all the way down, squeezing the ball all the way up from our push-up. Okay, so down and up. Now remember if you're against the wall and you're doing wall push-ups, it's looking pretty much the same. Okay, so down and up. Down and up. Squeeze the ball between the knees, between those legs. Make sure that they are, she's gonna hit me in the head with that. Down and up. Good. One more, this time we're gonna come down halfway and pulse it. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, take a quick little break on those tricep push-ups. All right, guys, you ready? Second round, and let's go. Take it down and up, down and up. Take 
move up. Let's take a look at your squishy. Down and up. There's four, three, two, and one. Hi, Buffy. Take it down halfway and pulse it. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, guys. Quick stretch for those triceps. Oh no, you're not going to pop this one too. All right, here we go. Bring it back up. Grab another quick drink of water. And we are going to hold this ball um, overhead here. So we're going to do a side lunge. Okay, so we're going to start right here. Side lunge, reach down, and then back up. We're going to switch sides on that, and then we are going to do some front leg lifts. All right, shoulders are back. And you move your stuff, Buffy. All right, are you guys ready? Arms are up, and let's go side lunge. Just bringing that ball towards the knee. Side lunge, left leg or this leg is staying nice and straight. Reach and in, reach. Now your heart rate might be getting up just a little bit, slightly, you might be starting to break a little bit of a sweat. Okay, so you're moving. Starting to breathe a little bit heavier because we're taking our arms above our heart. Okay, this is how we increase our heart rate. Either that or you use those large muscles in your legs and you bring your feet up off the floor. Something like that is gonna increase that heart rate. Watch out, puppy boo. Good, one more. Hold to the center and let's switch sides. Side lunge and reach. Side lunge and reach. Push those hips back. Keep those arms nice and straight and reach. Up and reach. There's four, three, two, and a one. Awesome job. Roll those shoulders out really quick. All right, arms are gonna go back up overhead. And we're just gonna reach um, the ball towards the foot. Okay, so it's not really a kick, it's a lift. So we're using this area right through here to support Lifting the leg up, so we're working the quads. We're working those hips and those lower abdominals, okay? So, some ab work, right? And then getting the heart rate up slightly with the little ball above the head. All right, guys, you ready? Get set, let's go. Lift. And you can also just use one arm if you'd like, opposite arm if you need a little balance assistance. You can use um, this arm over here. Or you can use both arms in range. Just watch your lower back on this. Tummy's in. Stay nice and tall. Let's do four more. Three, two, and a one. Good, let's switch sides. Watch out, Buffy, you can get hit in the head. Here we go. Keep reaching out there. Let's do four more. There's three, two, and a one. Awesome job. Row those shoulders out. All right. <clears throat> oh, yay. All right, so we are going to um, do a side lunge with our ball again, but we're gonna stay stationary right here, okay? So we're gonna hold the ball, 
out to the side, and then we're gonna come back in. So side lunge and in, side and in. You don't have to hold the ball, okay? So if it's just like a little bit of a distraction for you, you can put it down. Make sure that this knee is pointing the same direction that your toes are pointed. So I really would like for you to have your foot slightly out at an angle. Try not to bend forward, keep the chest lifted nice and tall and just lunge out. Now, if you haven't taken a big enough step out to the side here, like if it looks something like this, okay, you're gonna hurt yourself. So make sure that you step out big enough that you can really reach out there. You should be feeling this in your quads. Two more. Last one, and let's switch sides. So I'm already in a good position here. I'm gonna just turn this foot out slightly. Just change hands with the ball, and let's go take it out, and in, out, and in, out, and in. Good. Hope she doesn't choke on that. The little piece to the ball, you know, the plug came out when she popped it and so now she's chewing on the little plug. If that was a human baby, we would be like all over it, like, Kimmy, that you're gonna choke. Here's four, three, two, and a one. Excellent job, guys. My legs are starting to feel pretty good here. All right. We are now going to do a little bit of chest work. And then we're going to just cool it down really quick. All right. So arms are up. Okay. Right here, I'm going to point my fingers to the ceiling. Elbows are going to stay up. So I don't want your elbows to be on. So elbows are away from the body. Fingers are up. You're going to use the palms of your hands here to pulse the ball. Ready? Let's go. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Side view, pulse, pulse. Elbows up. So working the pectoral muscles here. You're going to feel it under your armpits. Okay? So this is one of those great moves that you're using everything in the front of your body and you're getting into those armpits. This is a great one. And getting into the back a little bit. Good. Pulse, pulse. Pulse, pulse. Come on, push a little bit more from the palms of those hands. Really try to flatten that ball. Stand nice and tall, bring those feet in a little bit closer together so you're in a good, uh, strong position here. Pulse, 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 pulse. Tummy's in, breathe. It's four, three, Two and a one. Awesome. Roll those shoulders out. All right, guys, you can put your squishy down. Put it away. All right, we're going to do some standing cool down. We got about a minute and a half left. So we're just going to bring it up. Big inhale and then exhale. Tilt all the way forward. Bellies in. Reach the fingertips to the floor the best you can. Tuck the chin to the chest. Inhale and exhale as we roll up. Good, one more time. Big reach up. Tilt forward, exhale as we come all the way down. Back flat, reach those fingertips to the floor. Tuck the chin to the chest. Big inhale and exhale as we roll all the way back up. Some shoulder rolls around and down. Good, and reverse direction. Take it forward and down. guys and let's go ahead and cross this leg over your other I'm not really sure if the camera is picking this up as your right or this is your right so I'm just gonna say cross this leg over this leg big reach oh feels nice and switch sides shoulders back big reach over Nice, back to center, one big inhale up, big 
big exhale down one more time guys big inhale up and big exhale thank you so much for joining me on our first bar class i will continue to record these for you guys on patreon and put them up there for you to do your quick workouts when you've got 20 minutes Okay, so just remember that you're not getting a total body workout on this. I mean, you are with the legs and the squats and stuff, but we're not working every single muscle, every bar class. Okay, so 20 minutes, we don't have enough time to do that. So we're going to pick like um, two or three different muscle groups and work those the best we can to exhaustion. And then you guys will have an arsenal of, of classes to pick from eventually as I get them uploaded to you over the next few months. And then uh, you could put them together and do a 40 minute workout or you could put it all together and you know, three of them and have an hour workout. Okay, so it's whatever works with your schedule. All right, guys, so have a blessed day and thank you so much for joining me and I really do appreciate your support. All right, guys, take care.